Hi, welcome to another video to do with BandLab for Education. Um, this one, or this video is looking at how do you share your assignments to your classes. Um, there's lots of different ways that um, as teachers we want to be able to share things and we want them to be able to be simple and streamlined. Um, the way I tend to do this is to use Google Classroom, but not everybody has Google Classroom. Okay, um, there is a link nearby um, that will show you how to do that one. But if you don't use Google Classroom, there is a bit of a workaround in being able to share um, your assignments with your classes on your lesson plans and those sorts of things, depending on what sort of platform you happen to be using with your school. There are so many different um, classroom management um, programs and infrastructures that schools have to pick from, um, and not every school um, countrywide or even worldwide um, uses the same sorts of platforms. So this little workaround will hopefully be able to work for you in your situation. So let's get into this. Okay, here we are inside my um, BandLab account and I've got my class that I'm using as my bit of a demo here. Um, this page is generally your main sort of stream page or feed page where you have all your assignments that students will find when you land inside um, your classroom here in BandLab. Okay, now the part that I want to bring to your attention is right up the top, but I need to move things around a bit so that we can see the URL. Now this URL is specific to your account and your class. Um, if I went into another class that I've got, it'll be a different URL that will be there. So you could actually copy that paste and put it wherever you want to have it for students to be able to have a direct link from your platform to here. Okay, now if I go into this assignment, you can see that this URL also changes, okay, to match this particular page. So I can take this URL and put that wherever I want it to be. So um, if you go into Google Classroom, you've got the share option, that's built in. But if you go with the URL, and I'll do a quick shortcut copy of that one, okay? And let's now move over to one of the platforms I use with my school is called Compass. Um, I think it's an, an Australian made one. Um, you might be using something different. So hopefully this will give you some ideas on how you can adapt it for your one. So let's move over to that platform. Okay, so here we are, I'm in here and I'm in the middle of creating my assignment. Um, I've got my assignment description, I've got my learning intention success criteria of uh, what I want them to get out of this particular task. I've got a little bit of description here and down here, I've got a link. Now I wanna show you how I did that. So let's delete that. And all I did was type in, click here. And with a lot of programs that are around, if you highlight it, and then click on, turn it into a URL. And I can paste that in there. And now that's a clickable URL. Um, for some people, it might be that you've got to leave the URL there, okay, for students to copy and paste. That will still work, um, but I find it's nice to have a little bit clickable um, URL that looks quite nice. Other things I've got here, I've got a little bit more description, I've got other attachments, and I can turn off, if I want things visible, if I want to have conversations and grading, if I want to have grading in this particular platform rather than use the BandLab grading. Um, as I've mentioned in some other videos, if you happen to grade something in BandLab, um, it will be locked up and it won't be able to be edited again. So it's something that I've raised as a, um, I'd like to see a bit of a feature to be able to happen around that one as a future feature. So um, we'll see what happens as time goes on with the development of that one. Um, but now I've got everything set up, I've got a clickable link, I can click save and then parents and students will be able to see that and have access to that link. Okay, so hopefully that's given you a bit of a workaround or a hack to be able to um, share your assignments and the different pages you've got within your BandLab class to whatever platform you happen to be using. Um, as a challenge, comment below on what sort of platforms you've been able to share your links successfully with. Um, I'll be keen to know what they are and maybe other people will be able to 
be able to check out any other um, platforms that they've been um, told that work. Um, definitely hit subscribe if you want to know about any future videos. Click that one and if you click the notification bell you'll be able to know about future videos that I do. That will definitely help out this little channel that we've got going here. Okay, thanks for all. Thank <laughs> you.